Oh god, I was muted. Oh, I have to redo the intro. Oh my goodness, well then, at least y'all said something. You could, you could have just left me hanging. Alright, sorry about that. My OBS uh, is sometimes stupid. Anyways, woo, alright. Welcome everybody, welcome bro chachos. So, basically today we're going to be playing the games I've made. So these two games are, uh, right now we have Pig Game, that's the big one. That's the only one that's obviously done. And I also want to show you the progress I've made on the little uh, Nair game, right? OBS, I don't know, I, I turn on OBS, it's like, oh, mic? No, no, who cares about the mic? No, we don't need that. Anyways, yeah, so we're going to be checking out that. Kind of crazy, Perry's playing uh, Pika Game today. And that was really, really fun to watch. Oh my god. Ooh. Oh, that was so that was so exciting. It was such a good stream as well. I, uh, there were like six thousand people watching. I'm like, dude, that's that's my game. That's my game. It gives me more motivation. I want to make more games. I think it's also fun. Like, I'm I'm a streamer at heart, right? So I think the mo the coolest games you can make are games that streamers can play and that people can watch. And like, okay, I was ignore that. That that, that <laughs> ignore the Pikachu. Uh, we got a shiny that quick, dude. Okay, that's already great. See. God to your luck. Well, just just ignore the boulder. Ignore the boulder, he's fine. Anyways, you yeah, should do the reset donation? I don't think I have a big enough audience to uh, warrant doing that. It'd probably seem a little uh, greedy if I did it at my size. I don't know, maybe another day. I kinda I kinda wanna ramble on, right? Alright. Anyways, what was I saying? Wall Pikachu return? I don't know how to fix that. I I've tried changing Pikachu's hitbox, it does freaking nothing. And it's it's only Pikachu. It it is only Pikachu that does that, like on that wall. I, the same wall as well, I don't know why. Ooh, but what was I saying? Yeah, yeah, so, at my heart, I'm a streamer, right? So I wanna, I think it'd be really cool to build more games that are like kind of streaming oriented. So I was talking with Pear, like we were, we were on a call today, and so we kind of have our little game plan kind of built out for the next thing. We're working on the Nair Undertale thing, then I'm gonna be making the, uh, the Mario clone, right? But after that, I was like, okay, what if we actually create a real game? Like, so far I've just been creating fan games, right? So, the Nair, uh, Pika game is a fan game of Suica game. The Mario will be a fan game of Mario. Undertale's fan game of Undertale, right? Where's the icons at the top? I'm kind of using, I'm using the same layout Pear used for his stream, because, like, it was actually really good. So, uh, no icons. I might put them at the very bottom this time. But I can't really put them at the top, because it's where, uh, Swablu and, uh, everything else is. Alright, so what was I saying? Uh... Yeah, yeah, so we're getting to a discussion, right? What, what's a good game that, like, could work for, like, streamers or something? And so, I, I'm trying to think, I was trying to be, like, smart. What if, what if we make a Mario Party game? It, it'll be harder than anything else I've ever made, right? That's why it's gonna have to be after I've made the other stuff. But, think about it, think about it. A Mario game, a uh, Mario Party-like style game, like, it, it, basically a party game. And it's on, like, maybe, like, Steam or something. That would be sick. And it'd be multiplayer. And I would pro I'd probably get, like, some content creators and have them do it first. Ooh. For, like, some, like, good advertising. Oh, that'd be sick. That'd be so sick. I think it's possible. I think it would be possible, right? Ooh, my god. Just think of that. That's so fun. Streamable content? Yeah, because you can get your, own, you can get your four buddies and you can play it. And then you can do it again, right? Oh my god, would it be free? Uh, that's the debatable part, right? If it would be not using- if it would be completely like my own stuff, right? Then it would probably be- Oh, we got a shiny Tepu Lele. Uh, it would probably be like maybe a dollar ninety-nine on Steam, right? I don't know, that's- that's the thought. It would probably be cheap because it- like, accessible. But, <laughs> ooh, if I was using all my own assets, maybe at that point. I don't know, doesn't really matter. Not gonna happen soon, that, that's not happening soon, but that's just like- that's like a cool thought. Alright, but yo, Pear, yo, I saw you playing Pika Game, dude, that was so good, that was such a good stream. Oh my god, I think the potential of a multiple, uh, multiplayer Mario Party on stream. Yeah, think about that, think about that. And also, the thing about Mario Party, it's $60, and it's exclusive to Nintendo. So if we made, like, a really cheap Mario Party that is on computer, think about it, think about it. You can make a narrow, narrow would probably, it'd probably be like, I don't know if I could straight up call it Nara Party, right? But... That would be the idea. Nero would be obviously a playable character slash the mascot of the game, I think. I'd be a little tricky though. In order to make a real game, I'd also need someone to help with the music. I could maybe reach out to Switch and Hollow Q because they were working on music uh, for the Nera Undertale game, right? Like they did that. 
I just realized how to improve the stream layout even more? Base? I don't know, so that's the question. Ooh, my goon is gracious. That, that's the thing. I think I think they would probably help, right? So, ooh, that's so fun. Though. That's, it's, so, it's so fun to think. That, that's obviously far away. That's obviously far away, but I think it's possible. I think it's possible. That, that, that's, that's what makes it so fun. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. All right. Oh, my God. God, dude, give, give it, give it, it's such a cool, it's so cool, because you can just make a game, you just, you just, you just put your mind to it, and then you make a game. Nintendo's very big on copyright, yeah, I want to call it Mario Party, style game too much, well, party games exist, party game is like a genre, right, there's, there's a few other games that have like, emulated the Mario Party style, okay, those Rotoms were literally touching, they were actually touching, did you finish the Undertale fan game, no, 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 that's gonna take a long time, that's gonna take a long time, I want to show. I want to show it off. I want to show what I have now. But I we we still got ways to go. We got ways to go. Oh man. Yeah, narrow game. Narrow. There is own game will come later on. I. Ooh, that, the the thing is when I make like the actual narrow game, like the real one. I want that to be like something special. You know, I I can't I can't jump straight into that. And ideally, I want people to know who Nara is beforehand. It's so, like they'd be willing to like invest. Because there's a lot of games that are, like, really good made, and nobody nobody gives a crap about what's going on, and so nobody sees it, right? That That's the hard part. We never cart. I don't, a racing game's actually really hard. I, I, I will stand up and say that already. I don't know if I want to try that. Woo! All right, but yeah. I don't know. It's just, it just fun content. It's, I'm, not, I'm not guaranteeing that's going to happen, but... It seems like it's a pretty good one. I saw one person ask, well, Pear actually played Nair Game once on the stream. I wish he finished it, but yeah. Ooh. Man. I touch. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Nair lore. There is a lot of Nair lore, and I've shared a little bit through the streams, but I think the best way to, like, share the lore would be through a game, right? Ooh, I think, I think just shoving it, like, in a wall of text somewhere, or somewhere sneaky wouldn't be the best. I think having it come out naturally would be the best. Yeah, Dacha's here. Say hi to Dacha. Alright, Weedle, Weedle, Whooper, Whooper. Alright. Ooh, but Nerolor is not gonna... I don't, I don't know the best way to do it outside of a game. There'll be a little bit of Nerolor inside the uh, the Undertale game. Because basically, uh, say, uh, not, I was about to say Sans. Sans and Nero are gonna talk to each other. No. Nero and uh, First School uh, basically have little chats. And we'll get some, we'll get some little conversations out of that. So that's fun. Alright. Hell yeah. Have you ever played... Oh, wait, no, you're, you're talking to Dacha. Shoot. Like, have you ever played Borderlands? No, I haven't, but you're asking Dacha. Yo, we're gonna get a late. Nice. What would Nera's voice sound like? That's a challenging thing. I... I don't know. She's young, but there's a lot of, like, ways you could make her sound, right? That... That's the hard part. Wait, have, is this still the first run? Have we, have we not died? I guess not. Alright, not too bad. Woo! Let's see, let's see. All right, drop that there. Drop these two here. I wrote them there. Okay, so we can drop like something to get rid of that Pikachu or fuse the Pikachu over there. That'd be good. I actually play P4 off stream. I do want to play uh, Persona 4 eventually, right? That's Nair's voice? Wait, what do you mean that's Nair's voice? I don't know. I would... It's kind of hard. Voice acting is a very, very tricky thing. It is it is an art. What's your favorite Pokemon? Hard to say. Really hard to say. It's, it's not easy. Imagine Nerys does like hacked. I I do not imagine that. I don't. I quite frankly do not. Oh yeah, this is definitely another. We definitely did die. I remember reading a shiny earlier. All right, hack smasher past Freddy Fazbear. You realize that's not just a child, but a dead child. I I'm I'm just I'm just saying that that just doesn't work out. Okay. Uh, I don't know why it's always Pikachu. It's always Pikachu inside the wall. What the frick? It, it's always freaking Pikachu. Okay, put Pikachu over there. Uh, double Wooper. Boom. Boom. Okay, Garchomp is on the top. That's kind of not the play. That's kind of bad, actually. Usually, you want the bigger things on the very bottom. Having the Rotom below Garchomp, I, I don't know if I can really fix that. Like, I can I can feed little dudes into the hole. But that that might be a problem. Roblox or Minecraft? Way Minecraft. Minecraft is definitely the answer. Why is Freddy a dead child? Because he died. Duh, he was killed. Duh. Come on, come on, baby. Shrimp as that. What do I do with this Pikachu? 
Gotta catch them all. Oh, that's, that's so good. Oh my god. I, I still don't know how to fix that glitch. I would I would have fixed it. I would have fixed the uh, little Pikachu clip. I genuinely don't know. I, I've changed his hitbox and everything. It is one of those like funny little things. We just have to accept it. It's caused by his hitbox. I've changed his hitbox. I have physically given him a new hitbox. So everybody has a hitbox where it's like the shape of them. I've get I've I've literally changed Pikachu's hitbox to just a plain circle and he still clips. I I don't know why. I I physically have no idea why he does that. He just he just Oh, that's kind of on me. I'm I'm literally an idiot. Okay. Anyways, I wanted to show you how the uh the narrow game is coming along as well. So, I did make a little bit of progress on that. Pause that. Ooh, I made a little bit of progress. So, Undertale versus Nera, baby. I, I, I did not a ton of progress. Game design takes forever, but... Okay, so, as you can see, we get the typing sound effect turned on, right? All this works, blah, blah, blah. We can click that. We can click out of that. It works. Okay, okay. We're coming together, we're coming together. We spare, she talks. Ayo. And then... Making progress! Making progress! That's basically that's basically all there there's But but as you can see, like health went down, we can take damage, we, we get all that. Kinda crazy, dude! You, you can just you're gonna sit down and make games. Oh, it's taking freaking forever. But here we go. You got the attack working? Yes. Oh, uh, just just thought it'd be funnish enough. Anyways, back to pick a game, back to pick a game. Ooh. Oh my goodness gracious. What do you mean her humming is not very good? She's, she's not good at humming. Oh, you know those people who are like toad and deaf and they're like trying to go... You know, it's, it's, just, it's just bad. <laughs> oh. Alright. Oh my god. But yeah, isn't that crazy? I got the attack working. I got that and ooh. So... Basically, the plan is I need to finish all the UI elements. I need to get the items working. I need to get act working. I need to get fight working, right? And then after that, it's basically just uh, the creative part where I need to get dialogue and attacks done. Right, where's the milk? I don't have the bottom today. I might turn on the bot later, but we're just we're just doing some natural stuff right now. We already got up Rotom that quickly. That's kind of kind of wild. All right, but yeah. Ooh, man, isn't that so, that's so cool? I I love I love this. I love my job. If only, if only I made money. Dude, Pika Games has been downloaded over 8,000 times. I have, I've got, I've made $20 off a of Pika Game, but that's because I, I have ads on the video. <laughs> that's all I've got. Uh, that's all I've got. Ooh, that's fine, that's fine. That's why I'm thinking, like, in the future, I need, to, I need, I need at least the $1.99 on the multiplayer thingy. Oh, if I can get one game that actually costs, like, the bare minimum then I can actually afford to do it, like, long-term. Because think about it, think about it. Think of it like this. If 8,000, if it's 8,000 downloads... Okay, it'd, it'd probably be downloaded a lot less if it costs money, let's be real. But... If you can make $60,000 a year, that's enough money to keep on going, uh, to do YouTube full-time. Yeah, 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 60,000 is enough for full-time. That's enough for rent. Yeah, yeah, I think so. I, I think so. Maybe it, maybe it depends on where you live. Maybe if you live in, like, Los Angeles, that, that's not going to cook, but... That would cook where I live. Well, Pedro stream this? Yes, I was there. I, I mean, it's my game, so... Ooh, I would hope, I would hope. I try, I try to keep out and uh, know what big guys are playing uh, pick a game. The combo! The combo! You saw that! Maybe for one dollar, that's 8k? Keep in mind, 8k, that's, that's great. Not enough to like quit your day job over, but you you keep on making games and just things keep ha you only get better, right? There's there's a lot of places to go. I don't know. It, there's just it's it's a it's a really cool thing, and then you also make the YouTube video. It's 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 basically a content farm, except moral. Ooh, you you can make a game. Literally, you're the first person to ever stream and all that stuff. Huge. How oh, dare you stream this when you made it? I know, right? I know, right? Dude, I was, I was telling Pear like. Okay, I'm stealing your stream overlay. It's kind of good. He was like, dude, you made the game. It's true, true. Like, Pear... Like, I made the game. I literally have the assets for it. Like, this this isn't this isn't a screenshot or anything. This is the freaking asset from the game. <laughs> oh, my God. 
can only do that because I'm I'm the guy. I'm that guy. I'm literally that guy. Oh, oh, can you explain the jump scare? Okay, I'll do it. I'll do it. Ooh. I'll do the jump scare. Hold on. So, something I noticed is you didn't, you didn't actually hear the jump scare when Pear did it. Because Pear had the sound effects off, right? So. We'll see. We'll see. Well, we won't do it immediately. Patience is key. Parabrine? Yeah, yeah. I'll, 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 I'll give you the, the lore on that afterwards. We'll, we'll, we'll get the lore on that in a moment. Alright, but let's just let's flip the pick, uh, pick a game for now. We'll do the jump scare in, a, in like a minute or so. I'll, I'll show you how it's done. How do you do it? I'll show you, I'll show you. I gotta I got set it up though. Alright. Ooh. Let's see, so this is a pretty... This is a garbage run! What happens after Arceus? If you get two Arceus to touch, it spawns a Tropius. There's been one person who's legit gone to Tropius. How do you get into making games? Well, first off, you need to know coding, right? That is that is the bare minimum. Uh, that, that's really the bare minimum, right? Everything else is like nice things to have. Like, you need to know graphic design, you need to know art design, you need to know game design. But none of that, you can't use any of that unless you know how to actually code as well. And you don't have to be a god at coding. Lord knows Toby Fox was, was trash at coding, right? Just be determined, and if something doesn't work out, don't be afraid to find a workaround. Some, like, lots of games, you'll, you'll see games out there, and they'll find interesting solutions to solve complex problems. Like, there's a, there's a door in Mario Galaxy that you, you click on it and you can read it, but it's not actually a door. There, there's literally just a sign behind the door. Like, there, there's really, there's developers who are really smart, and half a, half a game design is really that. And if you might be worried about, like, having to optimize your game for it to run well, make a 2D game. Like, 3D games, they're, they're kind of tricky to optimize, and 3D modeling is hard. I, I personally can't 3D model. You know, that, that's the reason I can't make 3D games. But there's a lot I can do with 2D stuff. And 2D games don't have to be optimized as well, so the, the barrier for entry is not as bad, you know? Google's key? Yeah, sir, if you have a problem, search it up. It's really that simple. You'll be like, how do you implement this? I guarantee 10,000 other people have already uh, probably asked it already, you know? How to implement text effect. How to implement... Touch! Touch! Oh, it worked. See, if you yell at your problems, they go away. Uh, 10,000 people have uh, asked how to, how to make an NPC. How to make a gun that shoots, right? And you just kind of learn. You need to be able to understand the code. Like, they'll have the code there you can copy and put in your game. It'll, it'll work. But if you don't know how to do it, you can't change it for, like... You can't change it. That's the hard part. You do need to be able to understand code. Why is the whooper in the ground? You know how to shoot a gun, but you know how to shoot a gun, how to make a gun shoot, right? Anyways. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, wait, we can get the duplicate gun now. No! I meant for the other one. Whatever. That works out. Kinda. Oh. Ooh. That wasn't really a good run, though. That, that was a really bad start, so it just wasn't gonna work out. We already know that. Alright, alright. But yeah, I, I, would, I would say coding is the, like... Biggest barrier of entry, but there's really no reason anyone can't code. And like I said, you don't need to be a god. Has everyone liked the stream? Oh yeah, like the stream, it helps out a lot, I imagine. I, I think it does. I think it does. Pear asked everyone to like the stream, and you know, the, the algo started going. There's free courses on YouTube. There's there's free courses everywhere. Ooh. Also, also ideas is a lot. All, creativity is a huge part of it. You, you need to be able to like do fun stuff. What type of code do you start out? The easiest code to usually begin is Python. Python's usually taught in a lot of the schools as like the first one, and then you get transitioned over to something a little bit more uh, optimized, right? Python's not the best. Games usually aren't ran in Python because Python, it's just not very efficient, you know? So like when I was in school, I learned Python first, and then they basically taught us the C++ after that. C++ is what? Fortnite, Mario Galaxy. C++ is a pretty standard for uh, game design, right? It, it, it's a good language. It's, it's much harder though. So, uh, yeah, so usually, usually people start with Python, and that's where you can learn a lot of the basics. Uh, Unity, which is what I actually make my games in, it runs on C Sharp, which has similarities with C, but isn't really, it's not C. Like, C, there's C, which is, like, lame C++. There's C++, which is cooler C. There's C Sharp, which is, like, the weird uncle who, like, isn't actually related, but whatever. 
You know, very, <laughs> very strange, very strange. All right. When? Oh yeah, will not, will not mentioning ASM. ASM is a sibling language. Do not make a game in ASM. You will kill yourself. You will, you will actually kill yourself. I, the only game I know that's even made in ASM is like, uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon. Well, ASM is extremely efficient, hard as hell, not worth, not worth. Try to learn T++ as your first? That's probably not a good idea, no. Yo, what's up? Hello there, Derpy Toodle. Yeah, C++ is not worth as a first. I mean, it's good if you can master it, but like, ooh, the, uh, the dumping and everything, oh my god, not fun. What's good, heck, yo? Doing fine, doing fine, same classy. Alright, let's see. Almost got 100 viewers today. Dude, that's kind of sick. I need I need to mention this. Yesterday was the first time we ever hit 100 viewers naturally on a short stream, and we might be able to do it again. And it's, it's all thanks to, like, freaking Pika Game. How, how, dude, how is Pika Game actually the secret sauce? Alright. Do that, bing bong. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. If I can get a Dewblade here, it'll touch one of the Rotoms, and then obviously the Rotom will touch the Garchomp, right? It's, it's as easy as that. Boop. Okay, uh, that's not kind of where I need the do blade, but whatever the frick, whatever, it doesn't really matter. You like Minecraft or Fortnite? I play Minecraft a lot more because I'm not good at Fortnite. But I, I can respect a lot of what Fortnite does. Fortnite changes the game industry for, like, better. There we go, Tapu. Shrimple is that. Alright, let's see, let's put that there. Woo! Alright! So we got two Weedles. Uh, we can get that. Easy Rotom. Groudon, maybe? Hold on, if I can get Pikachu to move. They're not touching. Okay, if I, if I just make things move enough, they, they'll touch eventually, right? How many subs did you gain from Pear? Like 40. Pretty decent. It was a 5k sub stream, uh, 5k viewer stream. I imagine most people probably just went and like clicked the download button and didn't sub, but you know, I, I can appreciate them at least checking out uh, Pika Game. It's really cool to make something and actually have people uh, interact with it, you know? Even if it doesn't, like, value anything. How do you play the game? There's a link in the description. You just saw Royal Pair? Yeah, I'm the guy who made it. Hello, it's me. It's a me. Right. Ooh. So the Tapu's probably not going to touch, but that's fine. We need to get four Tapus in total to beat the game. So it's not, like, a big deal. We just got to make sure the next Tapu touches. That's fine. That's fine. We got to make sure one of the next Tapus uh, touches. Okay. Uh, it's not going to work out. Let's see. How do we do this? How do we go about this? If you single letter to Apple for the make a Mac version. Okay, for me to make a Mac version of Pika game, I would need a Mac to basically like load ah! That's how you do the jump scare. That's how you do the jump scare. <laughs> oh, holy holy sh holy shoot. That's how you do the jump scare. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, so for people that watch pair stream, uh, you 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 couldn't get the full experience because the uh, there's no uh, there's no sound effect on the on pair stream. We had the sound effects turned off. Ooh, but that's what, that's what it sounds like. Fun, right? You good, bro? Yeah, that's that's fine. That's fine. Just give me a heart attack. It comes <laughs> it comes out of freaking nowhere. Ooh, I love you. Uh, Hack hates jump scares and yet he puts one into his game. Okay, but it's funny. It's funny. How do you do it? Ooh. Not scary? When you have headphones on and you're focused on the game, may it might be a little different. If you have your like your phone in your other hand, like you're eating like your lasagna, it's a little different. If you're locked in, it's 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 pretty scary. Especially since you don't know what's coming. Anyways. Ooh. Should I? Should I? Should I? Should I explain? It might be fun if you'll find out the jump scare yourself. It might be fun if you find it yourself. So this version of Pika Game isn't available yet. This is version 1.4. I was actually waiting for a pair to stream it before I, uh, before I put it out there. I might... Uh, I might... Might just put it out there and see if you'll find the jump scare yourself. It's in the game, it's in the game. Mm-hmm. My, my only suggestions is, uh, press a lot of buttons! Press a lot of buttons! <laughs> the jump scare is funny as hell, though. Oh my god, I I am not scared. Weedle mode? Uh, we did we beat Weedle mode yesterday. We won't, let's beat the game legit. Weedle mode is easy as hell. It just takes forever. Cause you basically need like ten billion pieces. Woo! 
All right. It's like the body's basic jump here. It's not scary, but you're so focused on the notebook that body scares you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's something like that, right? Like, people, people are like, it's not scary. Yeah, because you, you have this in your other hand and you're eating, like, cereal. Wait, you missed Weedle Mode? Yeah, we beat Weedle Mode yesterday. Yeah, when, when we were streaming Kaizo Mario Galaxy, we made it to, like, some area where the game kept crashing. So we just kind of uh, bounced out. You got to sleep in a bit? Good luck with stream. Thanks for visiting as long as you did. Gotcha. Then on Garchomp Shiny? Garchomp Shiny, I wish it was better. It's very... It's just Garchomp, but less saturated. I get scared by moving PNGs? Yes, I, I made the PNG move. You know, the jump scare is actually one of the hardest parts to ever implement. So, you probably probably wouldn't even guess that. But the rest of this game is all physics-based. I've never had uh, like a game with like any AI or anything in it beforehand. Basically, when I say AI, I mean like the computer moves things itself, right? Everything in this is either static, or it's physics, or it's moved by the player, right? There's nothing moving itself. So I had to learn how to move objects automatically in order for the jump scare to work. And that's actually very useful. Because guess what game needs objects to move? Undertale, right? So really, really useful that I learned how to do that. Oh, I was just getting a call from my mom. What does she want? Let me, let me go, let me go uh, text her. Yo, on stream right now. All right, uh, we'll see, we'll see what she says. All right, she tried calling again, don't know. Love you, mom, love you, mom, but I'm a little, a little busy. You decided to, thank you, Mr. Skellybones. All right, this is kind of a bad setup. Okay, she says, talk to you later, great. You could change uh, Garchomp, Shiny, how would you? Okay, have you guys seen Shiny uh, Mega Garchomp? He's pink. I think that's kind of fire. It's not the best. I think the best uh, way they could do it have you seen Shiny Gibble? He looks so sexy. I wish I wish they kept the same color scheme. When you download it, you can't play it. You don't know why? You need to unzip the zip file. Oh, look at Shiny. Nice. Oh, speaking of Shinies. Yesterday, Goo Miles. Today, Pika Game. Tomorrow, Nera Sky. I am not... You or you do not create an open world game by yourself. Ain't no way. Don't, don't, even, don't even suggest that, Venom. Ooh, I'm going to try to create, like, niche little uh, goofy, uh, goofy all games. Ooh, things that are things that are more applicable to single developers. Gibble Shiny is good. He's really good. I really wish I wish the, they kept the shiny through the evolutions. I think we got the Dual Blade Shiny. He looks the Dual Blade Shiny looks better in game. Kind of looks bad in this. I I don't know why because I literally color picked the shiny from the actual uh, model. Whatever. Another one. Okay, we kind of cooking. Dude, you know the shinies are a good aspect. I think a good stream has like a little bit of luck and like unexpected things in it. And the shinies are just, they just add on to that. I generally, I might go as far to say Pick a Game is a better streaming game than Sweek a Game. I, 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 I'm going to say that. It's harder. It's more interesting. It's got shinies. It's got multiple modes. I, I, will, I will say it is it is a better a better streaming in this week game. I act, hi, hi Scythids. You're awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Uh, what now? I don't really have a good place for this whooper. I do whoop Weedle mode. We'll do what? No, I I, I want to say we'll do one Weedle mode, but we'll probably beat Weedle mode first try, and it'll just take ten thousand years. Do you like shiny drowsy? No, I don't like drowsy. I don't like drowsy as a Pokemon. He kind of bothers me. I think he's weird. Just like me for real. Okay, we have the Jubilate over there. It's even got jump scares. Yeah, it's even got jump scares. It's got everything a good game has. I mean, what good game doesn't have a jump scare in it? Obviously, a uh, duh. Okay, let's see. Do that. Okay, we can put that. We can play Get Up C Dots game. Yes, yes, that's that looks fun. Yo, where can I play it? The link is in the description. You can just download it on HDO for free. Oh my goodness, yo, but yo, Spritz. Can you show us how to get it? It's it, The link is literally in the description. In the description. Little three dots on the top right corner of your little uh, short stream, right? Click that. You can see link to it. Boom. Bada buoy. Install on your computer. Free, free virus. Free virus. Give me access to your entire computer. Let's go. Shiny Tapu is so hot. Oh my god. Dude, dude, dude. I'm so excited to play CDOT. Can I play your games on the stream act? Oh yeah, you can play my games. The narrow game's not done yet, but uh, 
Yeah, you can play Pika Game. Pika Game is available. It is it is design of streaming in mind. That's why I, I built in a toggle to turn off... Okay, I, I can't show you here. I'll show you when I die. There's a toggle to turn the music and sound effects on and off. Because I think that's useful for streaming. Like right now, I'm playing my own music, but we still have the sound effects on. I think that's an ideal way to play the game. Right? Custom music, but... I mean, uh, custom sound effects. I can't word. Uh, your own sound effects... Ah! I'm trying to word! Use the uh, sound effects of the actual game, but play whatever music you want. I think that's ideal. Where are the little guys at the top? There's not really space for them for this layout. I think this layout looks sick as hell. Alright. Smash it past the shiny? Tapu? Tapu? Lele is kinda hot, not gonna lie. I have a Tapu Lele in, uh, in actual Pokemon. Very good one. Will this game inject a Nair virus into your- Yeah, it's gonna inject a virus into your computer that, uh, when you- when you install it, it- it plays Pika game. Oh, these guys aren't gonna touch, are they? You don't hear any music? You don't? I can make it louder. It's playing. You're just- you're just not listening loud enough. It's a little bit louder now. Yo, Papyrus. Yo, my man. Howdy. Oh, man. Literally, literally my bone, man. Okay, Duplade. Ooh, you can put them at the top or the bottom. I would put them at the very bottom, yeah, I think. I, I, I would set it up. My only worry is that we are- is it free? Yes, it's free. I, I literally can't charge for it. It's, it's a Pokemon fan game. If I charge for it, Nintendo would be literally at my doorstep being like, Open up! Open up! We're gonna murder you! You know? And I, I'm not about that life. Ooh. Plus, if there wasn't Pokemon, I, don't, I, don't, I think, like, the, the fun is lost. Because otherwise it's just, like, lame Swicker game flow, and that's not fun. Alright, let's see. Ooh, I, I'm not I'm not ready for Nintendo. Nintendo famously has very aggressive lawyers. I famously am poor. These don't, that, that's not a good combo, is it? I mean, they'd probably just send you a DMCA and say, hey, take it down. But I, I'd rather not put time into something than have it just taken down like that. Okay, I do not think this is a good run. Shame, we got two shinies. What a, what a lame run. Did you see the color mixing? I did see it. Yes. Woo. Oh, wait. So, so, yeah, so... We can play the music, the built-in music, or not. We can turn the sound effects on. I think that's useful for, like, streaming. I think having sound effects on, but music off is, like, useful, because now we can play, like, other stuff. I can you name every Pokemon on the screen? On the screen? Whooper. I... Uh, Pikachu, Pikachu, Bulldor, Weedle. There's a Swablu at the top. If you want to go in the order of the wheel, it's Weedle, Wooper, Pikachu, Boulder, Mobile, Dewblade, Rotom, Garchomp, Tapu Lele, Groudon, Arceus. Shrimple is that. I mean, I put all I put all the Pokemon there, so yeah. You love the color palette of Nera? Let's go. That's not Weedle mode. Fine, we'll beat Weedle mode. It's gonna be super easy. We'll beat it really quickly. Weedle mode's literally just spam. <sighs> it's literally just spam. And the Weedles get too, uh, separated, you kind of have to, like, stop and, like, fix them. But otherwise, you, you just kind of, like, make sure the Weedles all touch. Hello, yo, what's up, Halo VR? Yeah, it's funny, though. Weedle mode was literally- I was just streaming it. And, like, chat was like, what do you put in a Weedle mode? Oh, we did it! You know, that's the cool thing about making your own game. You can literally just add in your own features and modes. You, you just sit there and, like, yeah, we'll do this. Should I add Gardevoir? No. We're good. Pick a game, the horny version. We have we have Gardevoir, Lili uh Lilligant, uh Vaporeon. Yeah, just just everybody everybody's favorite Pokemon. Alright. So Rotom has a disease right now. Literally the uh, the Weedle virus. Low pony, low pony. Yeah, how can I forget that, right? Ooh, get all the uh, the weird ones. Oh yeah, we oh we got a shiny weedle, nice. And we also hit 100 viewers. Congratulations. Would you make a Gen 5 version? No, there's no reason to make a Gen 5 version. I would rather have Pika Game be like accessible to anybody, no matter what generation they play. I mean, we don't have any Gen 8 or Gen 9 Pokemon, but Gen. Yeah, I mean. There's no pixel sprites for, uh, Gen 8. I mean, uh, Gen 9. And then Gen 8... It just doesn't have a good Pokemon. I mean, I like Runa Regis, but that's, like, that's, like, a Gen, Gen 8 kind of stinky. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh. Alright, just, just keep spamming over there. You have a question? How about you just ask the question, instead of saying, I have a question, you know? Lay it on me. Ooh, it won't let me open it. How do you unzip it? 
If you're on Windows, right click and press extract. Oh, we got another shiny. Right click and press extract all. And then you'll unzip the file into another folder and then run it then. Hacker pass, shiny will not pass. Wait, hacker, <laughs> hacker pass LVO. You've never played or taken interest in Pokemon? Well, for the most part, this is just sweet game of Pokemon elements, you know? So like, even if you don't know what a Pokemon is, I think I think it's still valid. Shinies are still like a fun thing to like observe. And the gameplay is still, no, it's still sweet game enough that I think anyone can understand it. Yeah, so Weedle Mode's really, can you make an app on the App Store? No, I can't. That would be illegal. I don't own the rights to Pokemon. I, so, shiny central, okay. I physically cannot make it an app. It is, I would literally be arrested. Well, sued, but if you can't pay the lawsuit, you get arrested. Ooh, simple as that. There, there's literally no reason to. Why are there only Weedle? We're playing Weedle mode. So it's not in the game right now in the public version. I'll, I'll probably upload version one. Dude, we're, we're getting shinies like crazy. I'll probably upload version 1.4 soon. And basically in version 1.4, if you click on the version number on the title screen over and over, you'll open up Weedle mode. I think making pick a game free was a win-win situation. It works out. I mean, I, I, I literally can't make it paid, so. It's, 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 win, win. I'm not interested in trying to make paid games immediately though. I, I wanna make, I wanna get practice. I wanna become better at games. And I also, I, 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 wanna, I wanna just get fun. I wanna get fun. I think it's cool if people can actually play something, you know? It's it's free content. I see other people playing it. Alfred played it. He got like 100,000 views or a, a billion bajillion views. Pear played it. He got like, why well, he was at, he had like 6,000 viewers. I got 20,000 views. I, I, got, I got 20 bucks on it. I need to unzip it on phone. You cannot run on phone. It does not work on phone. It is not designed for phone. Sorry, buddy. Did you play Undertone stream? I have played Undertale. Okay, okay. For those of you that are new, so the title of the stream is playing the games I made. So the main thing we're playing right now is this, but I'm also, the next game I'm working on is a Undertale fan game, right? So if we have a Papyrus in chat, I, th I think it's valid enough to show. Well, I just opened up uh, the wrong thing. I, I'm making an Undertale fan game as well, where you can fight the mascot of my channel. So I can show you how that's working. I'm building this from scratch. It's not a modern thing. I am building it from the ground up. All the games I make, are made from scratch, keep that in mind. Ooh, so this is this so far, right? Hold on, is it is it streaming yet? Yeah, it is. So I'm not too far into it, but yeah. See, see Undertale fan game? This, this, this is the one I'm working on next. We can fight her. It's just kind of a test stuff, but like, see, it's, it's working out, it's working out. Everything's coming together. Anyways, anyways, there's that. So yeah, yeah, yeah. For those saying to play Undertale, trust, trust. We're making, we're making our own thing. Nera Tale? It's going to be Undertale versus Nera because it's you, the, the game's just going to be a balance battle against her. I'm not going to be remaking the entirety of Undertale because keep in mind, Undertale was made in four years. Undertale Yellow was made in like seven years, and ooh, Deltarune, Deltarune's been in production for like ten billion years. I am, I'm not Toby Fox. I am, I'm not remaking that, but I, I think it's fun just to have like the boss fight. And since it's custom made in my own engine, I can add in whatever features I want. That that's why I'm doing that. Because I, I want to implement some uh unique uh systems into it. Also another shiny. What do you do next? After uh the Undertale, I'm gonna make uh, a Mario type game. Where you make my own like like Super Mario Bros. And then after that, I think I think the meta is a Mario Party. I dare you to shiny Tropius? No. Only one person in the world has ever gotten a Tropius. Funnily enough, the person who got a Tropius actually did get a shiny Tropius. But only one person has ever officially gone Atropius, which is insane. Ooh. All right. The fo Toby Fox is not working on the Daltrune. I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what he's doing. I'm going to be honest. Like, whoa. He's, I love Toby Fox, but like, what is he doing? Goodness gracious. Oh, he's got a team. He's got a budget now. Like, I don't know why. I do play Pokemon. Uh, I played Pokemon Sword and Shield back when it was like relevant. I streamed it back in the day, but uh, I haven't played it in a while. Ooh, I play Pokemon Violet. Uh, I haven't played Pokemon Violet in a while though. Can you please make your game on phone? No. Simple answer. No. Ooh. Let's see. You like Undertale Yellow? Undertale Yellow is good, but I think I'm more attached to the regular game. 
I think the regular game has just better characters. Papyrus and like Sans are just like some of the greatest characters in fiction. Have you played Pokemon X? Okay, let me just answer this. I've played every Pokemon generation except Gen 2. I own Pokemon Crystal, I just haven't played it. Is that Pokemon Black and White music? Yes, it's like... It's Stride and City, I think. I think. Been a while. Ooh. <laughs> Didn't Toby Fox say Chapter 3 is almost done? Look, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. You play Undertale again? You only watch streams when they're live? But I bet you'd play it again when it's a great game. Yeah, we play Undertale every now and then. Every now and then we do another playthrough of Undertale. Don't know when we'll do a next one, but yeah. Is this game easier or harder than Suica? This is much harder than Suica. Alpharad himself called this the Dark Souls of Suica games. Alpharad said Dark Souls of Suica games. It is harder than regular Suica. Right? Alpharad played this for 40 minutes and he could not even get Arceus. So, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty hard. It's... I I've seen some streamers play the game and they basically changed their rule over to, uh trying to get a Groudon rather than an Arceus because getting a Ar Arceus is that hard, right? Now we're playing Weedle mode. Weedle mode's actually way easier because you only have one thing, right? It's not random. Oh, uh, like we'll, we'll, we'll get an Arceus uh, first try with Weedle mode. Weedle mode's just a gimmick. It, it's a meme mode. Can't wait for Dano to cry during this game? Dude, I would be honored if Dano played it. Oh my God. I don't know if I can get Dano to play it. Dano doesn't actually, uh, Dano doesn't play Pokemon, so. I don't know if he would. Oh. Like, I know Dano. Like, I met him on the CBSMP, but he doesn't play Pokemon, so I don't know. I I don't know if I can get him to play it. That, that's the hard part. Ooh. Yeah. Maybe one day. See, that's the thing. That's the thing. Uh, When I was talking about making the Mario Party game, I was talking to Pear, and he was saying, if I could do it, it can probably get... Uh, he could probably get Pear, Bun Dun, Dano, and maybe like Johnny Razor, and they, they could all do like a collab on it like before it comes out. And that'd be like the craziest like advertising. Especially if it's like a dollar ninety nine. Oh my god. Dude, imagine that. Imagine that. See that my plate? We could get C Dot play it. Guys, guys, you should you should ask C Dot to play Pika Game. Ooh. Oh, Perry's streaming this too? Yeah, yeah. He's playing. He's playing my game. He's my buddy. Ooh. Alright. Do you like Mewtwo or Charizard? Ah, uh, they're good. A little overrated, but they're good. Ooh. Are you gonna ask him? I think I think it'd be good if the viewers ask. Because that's how actually Alfred played uh Pika game. Apparently, one of y'all went over to uh Alfred's chat and told him to play Pika game. And he did. So, if y'all could just like say like, and see us chat play pick a game, and you know, you know, maybe a little overrated. Okay, okay, maybe 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 a lot overrated, but you know what I mean. I kind of like the weird Pokemon. My favorite Gen One Pokemon is Magnemite, so you know I'm not exactly the normal guy. Magnemite's so cool though. He's so cool. Oh my god. Oh, you got Pokemon Mystery Dungeon music. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon is so good. You want to see that? Yes. Ooh. See, I mean, I think Cedot would respect it, right? Because Cedot's doing uh, game design as well. And, like, Cedot's a buddy, so I think it'd be cool. I think it'd be cool. You might, Cedot might bully me for the glitches, but I, I didn't take game design. See, I believe Cedot's taking game design. So, tell him to be nice. Tell him to be nice. There's glitches, but I don't know what the frick I'm doing, okay? I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. Magnemite's cute. Magnemite's so cool. He's so cool. He's like for Legends EA. Dude, Legends EA is going to be so good. Oh my god, I can't wait for Megas to be back. Megas were actually the best. What's the game name? It's called Pika Game. There's a link to it in the description. It's free to download. Alright, link is in the description. I am the creator of the game. It is me, Hack Crusade. Man, it's so funny though. Legend ZA killed. Legend ZA freaking killed Power World. Power World had like a billion people. As soon as the Legend ZA announcement came out, I never heard someone talk about Power World again. People were like, oh, Pokemon fell off. Pokemon is like, Megas are coming back. Power World, gone. Evaporated. Ooh, man. Alright, somebody asked, what do you think of Sandy Shocks? I love all the Paradox Pokemon. Unfortunately, Sandy Shocks sucks in battle. I wish he was a lot better. Shame's doing pretty good, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Shame's doing great. Sandy Shocks, unfortunately, sucks in battle. But I really like his design. I think he's fun. Ooh, big fan of the Magnemite lines as well as like all their like little evolutions and everything. Technically, Sandy Shocks is Magneton, but you know, same idea. 
Woo, did you make this game? Yes, I did. <laughs> Man, y'all are all coming. Imagine coming and you just see this, you're like, oh, this guy's just spamming Weedles. Yes, we are. We are spamming Weedles, but we're almost, uh, we're almost done. We have two Tapus. We are really close to getting a, another Garchomp. We can probably get a Groudon with the setup we have. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. You got Unreal Engine on your computer, it didn't work well? Unreal Engine's very powerful. Yo, Shiny Groudon. Alright, so basically we need one more Groudon. So to do that, we need one more Tapu. We have, Luckily, we already have half a Tapu already there. Let's see, hell yeah. It's like a Nuzlocke just spam Weedles. So true! This is, this is basically just level grinding. Alright, hell yeah, hell yeah. Just level grinding. Alright, Shiny Groudon's a little cringe. He's like, piss-colored. But, but, hear me out, Shiny Primal Groudon is one of the best Shinies in the game. Man, I, I love when Pokemon have like a bad Shiny, and then they get a form that has a better Shiny, right? Like, for example, Shiny Groudon sucks, Shiny Primal uh, Groudon is amazing. Shiny Garchomp sucks, Shiny Mega Garchomp is better? It's not God tier, it's better though. Uh, Shiny Gengar sucks, Shiny Mega Gengar and GMAX Gengar both peak. Hack on a scale of 1 to 10, how tired are you? Uh, not very tired, it's like 820. Ooh. Shiny Primal Gr Groudon will never be in another game. He's literally in Pokemon Go. <laughs> I don't know if that counts. Oh man. There's a chance, there's a chance Primal's return in Legend ZA. So I don't know if you know, but usually the anime and the games kind of correlate to each other. And right now, one of the things in the anime is that there is a... There's Zygarde and Rayquaza in the anime. And this is leading people to uh, predict that Mega Rayquaza and, like, the Primals may return to Legend ZA. And you might be like, why do you think that? Why do you think that? Hear me out, hear me out. Primals and Megas are kind of tied to each other in a way. And, well, how do I put it... How, how do you really explain? There's a, there's a good chance. There's, there's a good chance we might see Primals return. What's your plan on Shiny Primal? Shiny Primal Kyogre is also really good. It just... Sh Kyogre's regular Shiny was already good. He's, he's like the pink thing. I mean, the black one's good as well, but... Kyogre's like got a pretty good Shiny scheme. I'm not gonna lie. You know what would be really cool, though? What if, the, what if the Shinies for, like, Kyogre and Groudon were, like, opposite, right? Like, what if... Groudon had a blue shiny, and Kyogre had a red shiny. Ooh! Something I've heard people talk about is what if every Pokemon got, like, a second shiny form? So if you remember, Pokemon, uh, Pokemon Scar uh, Short and Shield, there were actually two types of shinies. There were square shinies and star shinies, right? And square shinies were more common from breeding, star shiny- No, square shinies were more common from, uh, catching the wild. And star shinies were more common from breeding, right? And so, what if they gave one type of shiny, a different color, and one type of shiny, uh, the normal color, right? Wouldn't that be crazy? Because basically a lot of the old shinies weren't done manually, so they suck. So it would basically be like redemption for some Pokemon that really need it. Alright. Woo, hell yeah. Let's keep on going. So we can get one more Dewblade, we'll, we'll basically have like that. Man, oh this music's so nostalgic, dude. Mystery gift. Hell yeah. Me and the lads grinding mystery gift. Ooh, I have no idea what you're talking about. Very cool, Papyrus. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Alright, let's see. L Game Freak? Game Freak has a lot they can do. They have they have a lot of money. They need to hire more people and work harder and take longer. Pokemon Pokemon has the potential to literally be the greatest franchise known to man. We just we just need to give Game Freak encouragement. The link sadly isn't working. Uh, it doesn't work on mobile. You'll have, you'll have to copy and paste it. Or you can type it in. Uh, if you're on PC though, it should work. I feel like I recognized you, so I went to sub, but you already were. Well, welcome, welcome. Yeah, you might have seen me. Uh, I was on the CBSMP. If uh, you watched that, I don't know. I know a lot of people did, especially if you're on shorts. I would, I had imagined you might have watched me there. Ooh. Yeah, Game Freak needs to, yeah, Game Freak has the easiest job. They, they make a ton of money. They have a widely popular series. Just, just, just make good game. Just, just make good game. Qu quite simple, actually. God, do you remember now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Ooh. What's the little dude in the corner? Ah, uh, sandwich. That's the mascot of the channel. That's Nera. Nera has a mode in this as well. We can switch this to Nera mode after this. Nera mode's actually a little bit easier than a uh, regular Pika game. Alright, are we actually gonna frick up Weedle mode? Weedle mode takes so long, I really don't wanna mess this up. Hold on, hold on. Okay, let's work over here. Okay, hell yeah. Woo! You feel like ZA should try with different boss system? Oh, I think the battle system was the worst part of Legends Arceus. I think the battle system was the worst. I, I would go as far to say Legends Arceus is one of the worst battle systems in the series. I think Legends Arceus did a lot of things right. Battle is not one of them. No! Screw Pokemon! Nero mode is not easier? I literally got Nero mode first try last time. I will literally, I'll beat Nero mode first try right now. First try. Nero mode is not easier. Oh, uh-huh, mm-hmm, yeah, mm -hmm, yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Ooh. Yeah, I feel, the fights didn't feel like Pokemon, they were annoying. The battle system sucks in Legends Arceus. I will stand by it. As a competitive Pokemon player, it it, it is absolutely, it is stupid, it is stinky. Mm, it's you by all forms. Yeah, it's my channel's mascot. This is all Nera. Okay, we're not gonna get this first try. We actually got really bad luck. You're the dev? That doesn't mean anything. A lot of times gamers are better than the devs. Literally skill issue. Ooh. What would your reaction be if you got a $100 donation? I'd be like, hey, oh, thank you. Ooh. Is that Nera as, uh, yeah, that's, that's Nera as Ashley from WarioWare. Yes. Yeah, that was my, that was a Halloween profile pic I had. What's the best game engine? I think Unity is a good one to start out with. If uh, you don't want to start out with Unity, Game Maker and uh, Godot are also some pretty easy ones to start with. IMO. I haven't used the... <laughs> I haven't used, uh, I, I used Game Maker once. I haven't done anything interesting in it. And I haven't used Godot, but I hear a lot of people talk about it. No, 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 what are you doing? It's fine, boom. Okay, we need one more Nera Santa, we win. Shoot. Okay. Wait, Phantom, what did you say? Nair mode used to be easier, but since you bounce Pika, Nair is still an easier version of the OG release? No, no, we'll, we'll, we'll beat Nair game really quickly. Trust, trust, trust. Ooh. They're making a two player mode? They are, yes. I did see that. Hack, are you winning, son? That was actually a really good run, yeah. We'll get this, we'll get this. Trust, just trust. There's a little bit of luck. Suica game has luck in it. It's, it's a luck game. Not 100% skill. But we had a really good run. Like, look at this. We have literally three things on the field right now. And we have a Nera Ashley. Nera Ashley is literally like an eighth of the way to the victory. What's well, underrated Pokemon that should get a Mega? Flygon. Well, a Flygon's not underrated, but it needs a Mega. Ooh. We're talking about an underrated Pokemon. Maybe like Magnezone or something. Or like Electivire. I didn't know people hated Electivire until recently. So uh, yeah, give him a mega. Yeah, I, I heard I heard people like sh pooping on Electivire. I'm like, really? I thought everybody loved Electivire. Let's see. Yeah, super easy. Boom, boom. Already near Santa. That's a quarter of the way there. We only need four of these. All right. Bing bong. Hell yeah, hell yeah. We kind of vibe and we kind of chillin. They touch. Okay, I don't know if I can get the others to touch, but that's actually fine. We can work that. We'll consider this an investment for later. Yeah, now these touch. Oh, that's actually bad, it's bad. What's overrated Pokemon? It's gonna be, okay. It's gonna be Charizard. It, it, that's literally the only answer. That, that is the only answer. Are you gonna be like, Pikachu, Pikachu's the mascot. He, he, he gets a pass. Charizard doesn't. Charizard's just a random starter. There, there's absolutely no reason for Charizard to be sent for so hard. Yeah, that was a bad run. The ending was bad. 
Ooh. Ending sucked, ending sucked. Okay. Come on, come on. Let's see. Bing. Okay, there we go. Look at that, there's two things on the field. Actually, actually go to with the sauce. Oh my god, we can get a Nera Santa that easy. Drop that there. Dude, Nera, it's easier? Dude, dude, I dare you, I dare you to be Pika game in less tries than this. I dare you to be Pika game in less tries. Because I'm about to get this. I'm literally halfway there already. Ooh, hell yeah. Favorite max evolution? Uh, I'm a big fan of uh, Garchomp, honestly. He's my homie. My home slice. Let's go. Okay, let's see. You have? Doubt, doubt. Do it right now. Do it right now. Let's see. You have to, you have to literally get on, beat it in three tries. Because I have just beaten this. It's that easy. It's that easy. That's the final one. Oh, it's, 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 it's harder than the main game. Oh, oh, narrow game is harder. Shut up, shut up. Easy, easy, super easy. Easy as hell. Oh, only, only, only took three tries. Not bad, not that bad. Shrimp was that. Anyways, back to base game. All right, back to Pokemon. People will be like, oh, oh, narrow game's hard. Weak, weak, pathetic, coward. We can play the rest of the game and not get uh, RCS. We can get the game. The link is in the description. What are you going to say, buddy? Dude, I literally, I literally got it. Venom, Venom, when he's watching me, like, get it really quickly. Oh, go, go, go. It's harder. I'm just, I'm just bad at the game. I, I dare you to get an RCS. I dare you. Get an RCS right now. Right now. And three tries. That's how long it took me to get Nera. Ooh. All right, shrimp is that, shrimp is that. Don't use an excuse, oh, you're the creator. You're good at this. You got an arson on your second try? Luck, it's literally luck. Go do it again right now. I don't care about second try. I got Nera first try yesterday, so don't care. It's literally like, you don't realize this game is actually like 95% luck. <laughs> you can get all Weedles and like the game's a lot easier. You can get all, if you got all Mobiles, the game would actually be extremely easy. Let's see. All right. Sorry, sorry, Bort. Borticus, you just, uh, skill issued. As the, as the person who made the game, I am literally allowed to give you, uh, skill issues. I, I, I'm legally allowed to pass those out. Sorry. Ooh. Let's see, let's see. Boop. Oh, not bad, not bad. Stand classy. You gonna make an open world game with Dark Souls difficulty? That's literally just Elden Ring. Boom. Boom, 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 doo, doo, doo. Also, we keep on using the word Dark Souls difficulty. No, no, we should we should say peak again difficulty. Yeah, yeah, that's the new that's the new game. All right, how do we get that to touch? Cumulative town? Hell yeah! Just realized you lost your own game. I literally won the last round. What do you mean? Let's see. Okay, so there's not really there's never a good place to put wheels. You never want wheels unless you get two wheels and you get a whooper, and whooper's fine. He's a fine little lad. Why does it get way less views? Because Pear has 2 million subs, LMAO. I may, I may think be the guy who made the game, but quite frankly, like, nobody's gonna like know who I am, you know? Ooh, it's, it's, it's just not the same. Not the same. Touch those. All right, let's see. Hacked early in stream? Yeah, but obviously, like, it, it's a hard game. It's a hard game. I think that means it's fair. Okay, I can do that. Touch that. Hmm. Kind of this kind of bad. Hmm. Okay, Roll Pair shout. Oh yeah, Roll Pair mentioned me several times in the stream. I was there. Every time he said uh, he said my name in the chat, it was like so true, so true. Ooh. Exclamation mark milk doesn't work. Yeah, it's because we don't have the uh, the bot for that to work right now. Okay, let's see. Grab that. Put that there. Dude, this is Treasure Town from Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Actually based. Actually so based. Unfathomably based. Okay, I uh, don't know if we can get that to touch from there. Play might be to do that. No! This is a bad run. Honestly, we're resetting. We don't have a shiny anything. There's nothing to lose. Giga voice? What do you mean, Giga voice? Like, Giga Chad voice? Maybe? 
All right, all right. Okay, let's see. We're still getting milk? No, there's no milk if the, uh, the bot's not on. If the bot's not on, there's no milk. So if you don't see the guys walking around, you don't get anything. Have you ever considered adding a mobile mode? I think I'm done with updates for this game. I want to work on uh, other games now, you know? What happened to Nepu Nepu? Nepu Nepu died. They caught a disease. Rest in pieces. All right, let's see. But yeah, I'm kind of done with this. I want to I wanna move on to create new stuff, right? I don't, I don't want to work. I don't want Pika game to be my entire legacy, if you know what I mean, right? That just that just want to be fun. I'm sure you would all understand, right? This this game is literally made off of a spooky game, which is like the trending game from like last year, you know? Not exactly where you want to leave off for the rest of the time. It's cool and it's good for streaming. Ooh. I don't, I don't know what else I would add, you know? Like, without being unnecessary. Like, obviously, you're like, oh, act, add a new map with new Pokemon in it. But why? Is that really necessary? Would that change the way the game's played? It's one of those, like, cosmetic things. Like, we have Nera Mode. Like, Nera Mode plays differently. It's based on the older version of the game. It's so, like, there's, there's some things that are just different. It's got one less roll, so it's like, it is different. Uh, Weedle Mode's obviously plays very differently but uh I don't, I don't have like any other like it's sweet game can't really add multiplayer to it because if i oh i don't I, don't, I, haven't, I haven't touched multiplayer multiplayer's a little tricky all right how to get tropius you get two rcs to touch all right we can get that to touch boom dublin okay not that bad not that bad. Not too shabby, yeah. We take that. But mobile. Okay! Okay, we're cooking! Not not that bad! Okay, a lot of whoopers. Let's find. Literally comboed into a uh, Garchomp. It works out, it works out. Okay, let's see. I say I will not say the UWU word. That is uh kinda kinda cringy, not gonna lie. We're better than that. Okay, let's see. Woo! Weedle, Pikachu. Okay, okay, kind of, kind of, not kind of nice. Ooh, like Legos. I Legos are too expensive. They're too expensive. Can't say I didn't have much Legos growing up because they are expensive as hell, man. Woo! Quite the pretty penny. Oh, we can drop that there. Bing, bing, boom. Right. Let's see, let's see. Is your opinion on Gorgies? I think it's nice. It's not a Pokemon I've ever been able to been like used in a run because it's a trade evolution. Trade evolutions are like kind of a pain in the butt to get. But I, I like Punkaboo more. I'll, I'll go with that. Okay, not a bad run. Ooh, we're actually a uh, Garchomp. Okay, not bad. Not too shabby. Okay, we can get a Dublade right here. I'm going to Moil on top. Okay, yeah. Pencil of Porygon. I do love, I love Porygon. I, whenever I play Platinum, I would try to, I would trade with myself to get a Porygon Z every single run. And it was like the coolest thing known to man. I mean, you have to use a Porygon, uh, Porygon 2 for most of the run, but still. Alright, let's see, let's see. Okay, not do Blade quite yet. Are you gonna go to bed? Well, thanks for coming as long as you did. You have a lot of Legos too? Legos are so, I, I didn't have the luxury. My parents were like very stingy of money growing up. Now, they have a good reason to. Both my, my parent, my mom is retired my dad just got laid off and so like right now they really need money it's like really good we were conservative for our money growing up like yeah they were they were very how do you trade yourself second ds i did ds and a 3ds and you just uh i would have pokemon platinum and pokemon diamond you trade yourself or pokemon platinum and soul silver whatever the frick i'm playing at the time all right let's see Woo! all right bing 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 we have pikachu what can we do with pikachu We'll put him there, we'll put him there. Drop that there, hell yeah. Everybody keeps asking for favorite Pokemon, okay. Well, we can, we can do like favorite Pokemon from like each generation, right? Hit a clip. Okay, we're gonna do the three skip, uh, the 360 No Weedle. Oh, oh my goodness, no, oh, no way, 360 Weedle. Whoa, whoa, no way. The, the Weedle clip, so cool. Uh, how can I give you Legos? I'm good, as, as, there's no reason to. Let's see. Drop that there. Bing bong. Ooh, not that. Not bad. Not bad. Name a car for an edit? 
The the Apple car, which was recently canceled. Isn't that interesting? Apple was working on that car for like a billion years and they just they just canceled it. Okay, we got two Tapus down there. So that's halfway to Arceus, because two Tapus make a Groudon, and two Groudons make an Arceus. So we're actually halfway there. A little bit over, because we have other stuff on the field, right? You keep asking most under Pokemon, but uh, there's not an easy answer for that. There's not an easy answer. All right, hell yeah, hell yeah. Boop, boop, boop. Oh, Pokemon Diamond and Pearl music. Oh yeah, oh yeah, baby. What a, what a good, what a good, dude. I, I will simp Diamond and Pearl. I will even, I will say I enjoyed BDSP. I 100% of them. I got the black card in the game, which means completing the Pokedex, getting a 100 win streak in the battle, uh, the battle tower. Uh, what was it? Doing all the contests and obviously beating the champion as well, right? I completely, like, ooh, I, I put my time. Also getting like 100, like, shiny statues, something stupid underground. Oh my god, I liked BDSP. I unironically liked BDSP. Feel bad for you? Why? Why? BDSP is not that bad. I liked it. I'm very nostalgic towards Gen 4. And just being able to play the game in 3D with quality of life features. I, I like I would have liked more, but I liked what I played. I had fun. Alright. Let's see. Do that. Weedle. Ooper. Okay, we're actually we're actually playing a fire. Why did two gods make a plant? A plant? You mean Rotom? Rotom's the only grass type here. I don't know what you mean. Oh wait, you're talking about Tropius! Oh! It's Tropius is a YouTuber. Simple as that. Oh, we need one more tapu. We got Groudon now. I was like a plant like Rotom, huh? What? Pokey Sweet Yeah yeah yeah, it's Pika game. Alright, if Gen 5 gets the BDS treatment, I, I hope B Gen 5 gets better than BDSP. I hope it does, but I would probably still buy it and still have fun, because I'm extremely nostalgic for Gen uh, 4 and 5. Gen 3, 4, and 5 are the gens I grew up playing. Like, th those are my home gens, and so I want them to be treated with love. And BDSP is kind of like a stain on the history of Pokemon, but I, I'm, I'm, I will still say that I, I enjoyed my time playing it, because I'm, I'm that, like, tied to the region. I'm the I'm the reason they're allowed to make the garbage. I feel bad. Oh my goodness. But it's fine, it's fine. Not too big of a deal. You wanna play Gen 6? I'm so sorry. And in my opinion, Kalos is the worst region. Sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Actually actually not really sorry, honestly. You should, you should play more Pokemon. Alright, let's see. We got options, we got options. Boldor, Boldor, boop, boop, boop. Okay, huge. Rotom right there. They're not touching. That's kind of annoying, but if I can get one more mobile over on the right side, we can get like a huge combo. Ooh, ooh this works, right? That's a little dangerous. I, I probably won't. Yeah, we'll, we'll just wait for a mobile to come naturally. Okay, um... What do we do? What do we do here? We're kind of in a dangerous spot. I think we put Pikachu there. Yeah, we do that. That's probably the way. We're kind of in danger, aren't we? <gasps> They're so close, and if they touch, they would they would get the crowd. They would, they would get the guy. Oh my god! Right, what do you think of Kanto? Overrated, cringe as hell. I don't want to go back to Kanto. Kanto's boring. Uh, there's there's a billion there's a billion games of Kanto in it. I've gone there enough. We we don't need more Kanto games. Lame lame as hell region. Sorry, I am I am not a Jin Warner. I am quite the opposite, actually. No! Jump scare y'all? Okay. Don't say I didn't warn you. Don't say I didn't warn you. Nuh-uh. Nuh-uh. Jump scare. Nuh-uh. It's not scary. It's not scary. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? Put in your phones and stare. You know what? Unova's go to. Unova's actually go to the sauce. Literally the cla the sauciest region out there. I think Unova as a region is the best region in the series. Best region in the series. As a region, like, oh my goodness. It's been on Encanto, never watched it. <laughs> oh. Let's see. Oh, they might, we might actually be able to get them to touch. Hmm. If I drop a whooper over there, maybe it is real? It's only the suspense. It's coming, it's coming. You don't know when it's coming, though. You don't know when it's coming. That, that's what makes it scary. Oh. 
Jump scare, oh boy. Every number? 23. 23, baby. That's a good number, right? Let's see. Hmm. Weedle, whooper. Right about now. Now! How, how about now? Now! How about now? How about, how about now? No. You can't, you, can't, you can't summon the jumps here. It, it comes when it wants to come, you know? You do not control the rate at which the jumps get scared. Let's see. Beep, 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 beep. Hey, yo. Guard jump combo. Nice. Not too shabby. Got 125 viewers? Yeah, it's pretty nasty. Pretty nice. I going crazy? Pick a game actually, like, really, like, good for streaming somehow. Like, we've been playing Kaizo Mario Galaxy the last few days. Me switching over? Dude, I, what, what if I switched over? I only stream the games I made. El Mio. We only stream Pick a Game and, like, some others, right? Oh, no need for anything else. We're, we're just gonna be playing our games. You can jump in this game and scare them. So true, bestie. Alright, you're gonna draw while watching your stream? Huge. Oh, wait! Wait, that, now that you mentioned it. Hold on, hold on. There is this one. Okay, uh. I'll, I'll show in a minute. I'll, I'll show after the jump scare. Hold on. It's coming, it's coming. I do not control the rate at which the jump scare comes, but it's coming. Anyways, what was I saying? Yeah, I, I wanna show you guys uh, something after this. Let's see. Because uh, there's actually some little. Uh, people have made some like little fan shorts. And actually, I wanna show them. They're, they're like really precious. I want their work to go credited, you know? Because I, I think it, it's really cool. And they have the comments disabled in the shorts, so I can't actually respond to them. So I think I will just, like, show them on stream. So that if they're watching, they'll see this. And considering they went to the fact of, like, making the shorts, there's a good chance they are watching this, right? Because, like, I mean, you have to be pretty dedicated for that, right? So, maybe. Do that. Boldor, bing bong. Hell yeah. Love to see that. No, they're so close to touching! Go. Whoa! Not bad, not too shabby. Alright, Pikachu. Wooper. Boldor, Mawile, hell yeah. Stay classy, my friends. Did you get jump scared again? No, no. Jump scare hasn't came yet. Oh. It'll come when you least expect it. Which should be now! 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 No, I'm sorry. It, it, it just it, it, it comes when it wants to come. <laughs> oh, all right. How about, how about now? No, eh. Not much you can do about it. It's funny. Ooh, let's see. Weedle. Oh, we can put Mawile there. Okay, huge. Boom. Bing, bing, bing. No, they're so close to touching. It's not actually coming. It's actually, it's actually a joke. I'm, I'm just... Oh, I got a shiny! I'm actually having you just watch for more retention. So true. You were actually, you were actually, uh, bamboozled. There is no jump scare. Take off your, uh... Take off your wallet. Ah! Well, there it was. Anyways, anyways. So I said I wanted to show you, uh, some, uh, little fan thingies. Okay. One moment, one second. Ooh, what a good stream though, what a good stream. Hell no, nah? it comes out of nowhere. There is no jump scare, also jump scare, hello there. Hello, hacked. Hold on, where is it? I think it's here. Yeah, mentions. Okay, so basically whenever you uh, make a little video, like some people will like mention me in it, and that's because their video like is somewhat like about me, right? So I wanna show you like, these like, look at this. Hack Crusade Stream Doodles? This is really cool. I wish I could have commented on it. Look at this, look at this. Isn't there, that's, that's a Goomba, Wooper, I have to kill myself? It's from yesterday. Bowser Jr. Super new. Oh man, it just, oh my God, I, I, I love these. I love, this is just so fun. That's so cool, that's so cool. My goodness gracious, people make this stuff. Uh, they, the comments disabled, so I, I can't say anything. I, I can't tell them I've seen it. But like, that's that's so fun. That's sick. It's it just, it's a bunch. Hold on, and then there's the Nepu Nepu speed paint. So if you watch the uh, the April Fool stream, basically I streamed as a uh, Nep. And so then they, they did a Nepu Nepu speed paint. Oh my God, that's so, that's so cool. Oh my God, like, shout out. That, that's, that's so cool. I, I look at this, uh, I'm like, 
oh my god, that's beast as hell. Someone should draw Nero's Nepu Nepu for real, for real. And then uh, there's one more video made by someone else after that that I want to show as well. But yeah, oh, I, I just lots of love, lots of love. Very talent. I love talented people. Yeah, if you use your talents for like cool stuff, Nepu Nepu. That's really cool. And then there's this. When we're playing the, uh, when we're making the Undertale fan game, someone did Nera versus Flowey? Kinda, kinda sick, not gonna lie. Like, that's kinda wild. I don't know. I, I just, I just needed to show that stuff. Like, that's, that's sick. Keep up the good work, guys. Like, I, I see it. If, if you think I don't see it, I see it. And I think it's cool as hell. Okay, well, well, what we were doing, uh, but we're going back to bigger game. Yeah, so that just that's just so fun. That's so cool. That's so cool. Oh my god. All right, that's generally amazing. That's that's crazy. Shonera fan art. Maybe one day. Maybe one day. Fan art stream. Oh, let's get the music back on. Okay. Yeah, so when I, if you make something, you tag me in it. I, I do check the tags. I check them, and... Oh my god. I did the jump scare happen? Yeah, the jump scare already happened. I you're done the verses there? I am not done, no. It is, it's gonna take a while to make. It's, it's pretty ambitious. Uh, I see why Undertale Yellow took seven years. <laughs> uh, my fight's not gonna be as interesting as an Undertale Yellow boss fight, but... Uh, it'll be fun. But the thing in the bottom right, that's the mascot of the channel. That is, uh, Nera. She's just eating a sandwich, though, so... Don't, don't pay too much mind to her. She just chills. Ooh. Alright, goal is we're gonna get an Arceus in the legit normal mode. Like I said, this game is harder than regular Suica game. Alpharad called it Dark Souls of Suica, so... Might take a while. That was... I wasn't looking. That was really bad. Where's Nera from? Nera is made for the channel. She is the channel mascot. She is not from anywhere. She's not from anything. She's... All the Nera art is mine. You show pair my fan art? No, no, not yet. Maybe eventually. No. <laughs> oh. Patience, maybe. Has Nera ever murdered someone? Y'all, oh, y'all don't even know who Nera is. Okay, let's get the Nera lore video out. Let's get the Nera lore video out. We need to catch you up. Ooh. Are you an artist? Yes, I do art. Yes. The little animation in the bottom right. I drew that. Am I good? That that that's a different thing. But do I do art? Yes. Okay. So let's get the narrow lore video out. So y'all y'all know y'all can y'all can get caught up. We, we can start somewhere, you know. No capture. Let's see. Boop. Boop. Okay. Let's get started. This is like the this is the oldest video on the channel that I have listed right now. So it's easy to find if you want to watch it. Okay, for thousands of years, a galactic empire ruled the cosmos. The fairies, giants, and dwarves were all united in peace by the empire of gods, blah blah blah. Of course, peace never lasts forever. No, no, of course not. On the home of the gods, there was a massacre by a small girl with wicked wings. But as gone as she arrived, I mean as quickly as she arrived, she was gone in a matter of moments. In return, the gods launched a search party across the entire empire. The attacker's rare traits were only found in one being. The young princess of Pharaoh, Nera. Okay. For her protection, she was placed in a small vessel and launched into the stars. While she drifted into the void, she was announced dead to the galaxy. Her destination was a place of pure evil, a barbaric land full of nothing but sin. The gods failed to control these beings and dared never to return. What planet was this? Earth. Let's go. And that's the, that's the narrow lore. Ten years have passed since that faithful day. Boom. That's crazy, that's crazy, dog. Anyways, that's not coming anytime soon. That's not coming anytime soon. If you do the video, Coming not soon, let's go! Yeah. So that, that's how that works. 
Ooh. Ooh, so that's the narrow lore, for those of you wondering, who is she? So the gods of Bendus and the narrow universe? Yes, the gods, they gave up trying to control Earth. Humans weren't worth their effort, and so they no longer worry about them. And humans just kind of doing their own thing. All right, so there's that, there's that. Yeah. So Nera came here basically to like hide from protection. Why is it called Nera? Because in uh, Greek, fairy means like Neride or something. So uh, yeah, that's where it came from. Shrimple is that, shrimple is that. Let's see. Boom, boom, boom. Ooh, this is, this is not a super good run. Might reset now, honestly, save us some time. But we literally suck, the gods didn't even want to help us, yep. Lying around from Earth, so true, so true! Yeah, so basically the lore, so that's like the established lore, that's like the everything before like Nera's time, right? Uh, what's going on like right now? Have you beat this game? Yeah, of course I beat it, I, I made the game. <laughs> I had to beat it to make sure it works. Ooh. What was I saying? Uh, yeah. So Nera is, she's living basically in the United Nations and she's being trained to be basically an alien ambassador for Earth so that Earth can basically send like an alien out there to be like, yo, Earth is super cool. You guys, you guys should totally be nice and do it. Uh, be nice to Earth and like do trade with Earth and everything. So Nera agrees to this because if Nera's the alien ambassador, she can get back to her planet uh, with like Earth technology, you know? And Earth wants to basically be a part of like the galaxy, right? Because right now the humans, they're they're kind of cut off from the rest of the galaxy because nobody wants to deal with them. Because they, basically the gods came during like the ancient times, during like the Greek era and everything. And like humans are pretty, pretty barbaric back then, right? You know? And the gods kind of like, were like, okay, these guys are a waste of time. And so they just haven't came back since. And so humanity's been kind of like improving technologically in their own ways. Separately from the rest of the universe, uh, the rest of the galaxy, I should say. And that's kind of that, that's kind of that. So how will, how will the interaction go? All I can say is that the day humanity makes contact with aliens will be as destructive as the day Christopher Columbus made contact with the natives in the Americas. I will say that, I will say that. How old is Nera? She's 13 or 14. Oh, we got a Tapu with a brain worm. Cool. So when I said 10 years ago, when Nera was sent over to Earth, she was around four. Woo. Let's see. But yeah, so that's the, that's the, that's the Nera lore. How fun is that? Fun, fun stuff. Ooh, bing, bing, bing. But the question is, will, uh, when I see, like, all the destruction from the two parties meeting, will it be, will it be Earth that's the one that's losing? Or will it perhaps be someone else from the stars? That's the question. Ooh. Alright. Let's see. Hold up, point of view, you make an alien that's basically a superhero but looks just like a normal movie? Nera? Imagine. Alright. I can't wait to, like, uh, do more stuff with Nera in the future, but... For now, she's just the fantastic mascot. I'm glad everybody likes them as much. I was a bit worried that people wouldn't have uh, liked Nair because, you know, she's kind of untraditional. We're going to full clip aliens? Maybe. Maybe. Is there blood red? Yes. Yes, it is. So you might ask, wait, she's an alien. Why is her blood red? Well, Nera's main composition is she's... Uh, this is this is something I've, like, talked in lore. She's from Ferrum, right? Pharaoh means iron. She's she's like an iron-based being, rather than like most earth creatures, which are carbon-based. And believe it or not, the reason our blood is red is because it has iron in it. So Nera's blood is logically red as well. You know? So this is this is one of those weirder, like more sciencey thingies. But every single metal has a real color to it, right? Like a lot of metals are like gray, like naturally, but they have they have a real color to it, right? And iron's real color is red. Like, if you get iron and it rusts, it turns red. If you get iron, you put iron dust into a, like, firework, it turns red and everything, you know? Like, that's how they make red fireworks, if, if you didn't know. Like, iron's real color is red. So, that, that's, that's just, like, one of those, like, little fun facts, so. 
Yeah, her blood, her blood's still red because it's just going to be more of that. So how to defeat Nera? Magnet. Yes, a magnet would be effective against Nera. Yes. Ooh, just be careful not to use an electromagnet. That might be uh, that might be bad. Can you be my science teacher? I would love to. Actually, this, this is something I learned like in uh, sixth grade science back in the day. So if they're not teaching you that, they're, they're not teaching you very good anyways. Lore's crazy? Well, the, the iron thing was literally just science. I just, the thing is, I basically want to have a, like a universe, like where there's magic and stuff, but all the magic is explained by like real science, you know? Like Nera can use uh, magic. It's like fire, electric, and like light stuff. But the reason she can do it is because they're positive energies. As in, when well, you're in sixth grade, Oh, like maybe like 12 or 13 years old, kind of, I, I think. Anyways, what was I saying? I want to explain it like using like scientific ways rather than just saying, oh, oh they, they believe really hard. Oh, they're, they're really nice and then the magic comes. Anyways, uh, what was I saying? Yeah, so positive energies, you know? Right, so she can't use like ice magic or anything because that, that's not an energy. That is, that is the lack of energy. So she's actually weak to that. Ooh, you know, things like that, things like that. I, th I think it's fun, like, before you implement something, think logically, why is this the way it is? Now, like, obviously you can have some, like, little, you can have some fun with it, like, it's, like, if we made it only real stuff, well, then, like, you know, we'd be boring, but yeah. There's a dual type electric fire? No, if I gave Nera a type, she'd be a steel fairy, because obviously she's a fairy, and then she's, she's made of metal. She can use different elements of, like, uh, magic, but, like, that, that'd be, like, moves in her move pool, but not necessarily her type. All right. Let's see. Do that, Pika. Okay, so we have three guard shops on the field. Hella, hella base. Not bad, not too shabby. Okay, we can get Nera in there. Ah, uh, no, Weedle in there. Oopsies. <laughs> Never mind. Let's see. Make a Tapu Nera? That is whole Iron Nera. Okay, let's see. Put that over there. Bing, bing. Okay, we got another Rotom. We're really close to another uh, Tapu, actually. Hmm. Let's see. How do we do this? How do we go about this? This might actually be a dead run. It's not actually that good, I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, this run's actually trash. Oh my god. We'll play it out, we'll play it out. But I don't know if there's any coming back. No, it's the top. Oh, if it touched, it would have gone down. All right, let's retry. Let's retry. Woo! Okay. Okay, back we go. Back we go. Double mobile early on. Okay, get a dual blade in the middle. Get a Rotom already? Huge! Okay. We wish you weren't broke so you need a membership. I do think our memberships are really cool. I drew a lot of the emojis for the memberships. Uh, let, me send, let me send the ones I drew. Because memberships are fun as hell. I drew this one. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. And that one. Which is really fun as hell. So the others were all drawn by friends. But, yeah. Ooh, emoji. Or, or they're, like, the troll face and the Among Us one. Like, those are obviously not mine either. But, yeah. Ooh. I like to think, I like to think our emojis have, like, good values. I like them, I like them, but I'm a little biased. What song does Nero like? It will make more sense later. I, I never thought hard about that. <laughs> I never thought hard about that. This game on a website or something? You can download it from itch.io, uh, itch yeah. If you go to the link in the description, you can get it there. Or you want a royal pair? Oh, I'm in many royal pair videos. I'm royal pair's uh, IRL friend. So, uh, I've, I've appeared in a few of his videos. Like, I'm in the up video. I'm in the, what, what other video? <laughs> I'm in a few of his shorts, I, I, do, I do know that. Me and a uh, pair planning a video soon. Ooh. But yeah, 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 I'm, I'm in several. I'm from the CVS MP as well, where pair, pair was also in that. Do you make the game? It cannot be played on mobile. No, I did not make it for mobile. Let's see. Let's see. How do we go about this? This is kind of a bad run. Having the dual blade on the bottom, I kind of just need to do it. Actually, make a 2D game on Unity to start. 
3D is a lot harder than 2D. Like, it's really useful to learn 3D. If you learn 3D, you can do anything. You can do anything. But it's hard to start. Would there be smarter or dumber than humans? Uh, depend, depends on the subject, actually. So, Nera is probably, like, average intellect in some things. So, so basically, to make up for, like, she's an alien, you'd be like, okay, so how does she talk then, right? How does she talk to people? She has the ability to, like, basically, like, translate any language. So, whatever language she's speaking, that you, you'll hear whatever, like, your native language is. And she can read, like, any language. Like, basically, there's, like, universal understanding. So, she can talk to anyone despite, like, whatever language it is. But because of that, she can't actually learn to read or, like, any of that. Like, she can read the text, but she, she can't actually know, like, the words or any of that stuff. So because of that, she can't write. She, she literally cannot learn to write because it, it just auto-translates to her language in her head. So there, there's physically no way to teach her. Like, if you try teaching her, like, the letters one by one, it, it just it just can't click. You, you, you can't. So it depends on, it depends on, like, she's smarter in some ways. Like, she, she's got weakness and, and strengths. Not being able to write is a huge weakness. Ooh. Hack, can we get her voice reveal? Hello. Will Malt Nera ever say something on the channel? Uh, I would need a voice actor. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. It's not like I'm, I'm not like Dano where I can just, you know, do it myself. Nera's a girl. I'm a guy. What type of Nera, uh, sandwich is she eating? I'm gonna go ahead and just say avocado sandwich. Cause I got freaking cucked by an avocado sandwich the other day. Oh man. Should I give you guys the avocado sandwich story again? I told it the other day, but it kind of pisses me off. Hey, can we get a Kermit the Frog? No, I, I've i never tried that. Nara can only write her language? That's the problem. That's the problem. So she can only write her language? But here's the issue. She, she left her planet when she was four years old. So she doesn't know how to write her own language either. She can't write. <laughs> Oh, that, that's her big flaw. She can read. She can literally be like reading Shakespeare and like understand it because like it gets automatically translated. But she can't write because she never learned how to write. Huge weakness. Ooh, man. I think it's funny though. I, th I think it's funny. Oh my god, Calvin got a membership. Love to see it. Oh my goodness. I want to get a girlfriend or wife. Would, would use her to voice. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna get a girlfriend for a while. I'm not gonna get a girlfriend anytime soon. It's on the sandwich. Avocado, I guess. I'm not getting a go for it any time, though. That, that's that's the problem. Oh, man. I wish, I wish. The thing is, I'm in engineering, right? There's, like, no girls in engineering. What, what girls, girls, girls? Girls in the chat, go to engineering. We're, we're so desperate. We're desperate. Wait, they thought a four-year-old just murdered people? Yes. Yes, Nero was framed for murder as a four-year-old. Ooh. So yeah, that, that, that is that is canonically lore. So Nera basically like literally had to leave her home because she was framed for murder as a four-year-old. Mm -hmm. Yeah. For some reason, they think like a four-year-old kid, uh, kid murdered some gods. Who's your favorite Pokemon? Probably like Nihil Lego or something. We'll just go with that. That's an easy answer. I don't know if it's like the true answer. Like It could also be Rotom. Rotom's really fire. Okay, I will say this right now. I put a lot of my favorite Pokemons in this. I really like Garchomp. I like Rotom. I like... Okay, I put Dewblade. Aegislash is better, but I love Aegislash. Like, I put... I'm not gonna lie. I put some of my favorite Pokemon in here. Wow, Hag, wow. Ooh. But I, I made the game. I'm allowed to do that, you know? Ooh. <laughs> I'm allowed to do that. When do, you, when do you make your own games? You get to uh, choose what you put in. Yo, Royal Pair. Hell yeah. Love to see that. What's the best starter? Ooh, I'm, I might go with Snivy or Rowlet. Or Bulbasaur. Oh no, it's Mudkip! Easy, easy Mudkip sweep. It's Mudkip. It's Mudkip. Done. Royal pair? Yeah, that's the real royal pair. Alright. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Ooh, say hi to your papa pair. Shrimple is that. He was watching, he was watching his stream? Yeah, 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 he was playing, he was playing a good game too. Isn't there a princess? Shouldn't she have royalty? She is royalty. But I uh, there's, there's details. There's these details we have to explain. Ooh. Nara lore is very long and complicated. There's there's a lot to it. I, I've thought about it for a long time. 
Glad you're growing. Remember when you only had 12 viewers per stream? Well, that's that's long streams. This this is a uh, this is a short stream, so it's a little different, you know. I think in our uh, our our long streams, last one we had like what 30 to 40 people. Which don't get me wrong, that's great. That that is amazing. I I, I also remember we're getting like 10 to 12, but yeah. Let's see. What does Nara do with her souls? Uh, she 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 just likes their neat. She puts them on the shelf. All right, let's see. Let's see. Drop that there. Ever start Cyndaquil? Not a bad one. Not a bad one. I don't think the Gen Two starters are my favorites personally. So, this is this is just my personal take. But did you know the Gen Two? For the most part, the Gen Two Pokemon were all made really simple, so they'd be easy to draw in the anime. They removed that rule for Gen Three, but because of that, a lot of the Gen Two Pokemon are like really simple. And like, you can tell that, like, you look at Gen 3, we have something like Metagross, ton of detail. You look at Gen 2, look at Meganadium. It's, it's literally like a lizard with flower on its neck. Like, I'm, I'm just saying, Gen 2 is just so simple, right? So I don't know. Their designs don't really click on me. I'm, I'm more of a fan of the fancy designs anyways. And I'm not saying you can't do anything go to the simple designs. I just think there's a lot more you can do with the fancy ones. Ooh, what starters do you want at Legend Z, eh? Ooh, ooh, that's a good question, that's a good question. Okay, let's get Superior. I think a, like, Noble Superior would be really fun. Let's get, uh, who'd be a good water type? Mudkip! Mudkip, Mudkip, Mudkip. And for Fire type, we have to get Lin. Because I think, I think giving Incineroar another form, ooh, another form of Incineroar would be so good. Oh my god, imagine another form of Incineroar. Dude, dude. For, for those of you who aren't aware, Incineroar is a top tier in the Pokemon competitive, uh, like Pokemon competitive, right? Imagine, imagine giving Incineroar another form that's better. Oh my god, dude, dude. Competitive Pokemon to be in shambles, it'd be so funny. What's Legends EA? So it's basically another version of uh, Legends Arceus, but like for Zygarde instead. They've already announced it's coming out next year. It's gonna be really good. They're bringing back Mega Evolution, it's gonna be in Kalos. Oh my god. Is it Incineroar Alola? The whole point of the Legends games is that they pick one starter from like random regions, right? So it doesn't matter that he's from Alola. Like, uh, Rowlet was the starter in uh, Legends Arceus. He's also from Alola. So there's no rule on who we can get in a Legends game. You saw Pear doing this? Well, I'm the one that made the game, so I'm allowed to play it as well. Shrimple as that. When you make games, you get to make your own rules too. Alright. Let's see. Still waiting for Legends Nera? Imagine that. Oh yeah, I put out the community post for that. I forgot about that. Okay, this is probably a dead run. I'm gonna be real. We might even get Arceus today. That's kind of that's kind of sad. Arceus is really hard to get. You don't play competitive Pokemon. I think competitive Pokemon's actually one of the most fun competitive games out there. You'll play like yeah, it's a dead run. You'll play like another competitive game like Smash Bros or something. You need like three thousand hours to even like be on like a valid level for competitive like Smash Bros or something. On Pokemon. All you have to do is you need to learn what the Pokemon are, which is really easy. Because competitive Pokemon, not every Pokemon is viable. You don't need to know every 1,000 Pokemon. In fact, you really, for the most part, you just need to know the top tiers and like a few gimmick sets. Right? And once you do that, you, you can literally play the same ability. Because it's, it's not skill, it's strategy. What's the name of the game? This is Pika Game. There's a link to it in the description. Right? So I think, I think competitive Pokemon is one of the coolest competitive ga uh, game scenes out there because it's really accessible. It's not like uh, a fighting game or, or a shooter or something. Like competitive Fortnite, you have to be like a tryhard. You, you literally can't tryhard Pokemon. You, you just choose your Pokemon, you fight. In fact, the cool thing about Pokemon is quite often you, you can pick your favorite. No, you can't, you're not going to be able to do a team of your full favorites, right? Unless your favorites are named Iron Hands and Fluttermane. But... Uh, for the most part, there, there's a way to make a lot of weird Pokemon viable. Like, I was fighting Pear. Pear made a viable Tropius. It was actually really fun. How do you play competitive Pokemon? Well, in the main game, you just go to the ranked battles, right? If you want to play it, like, for free online, there's a website called Pokemon Showdown. A lot of people play po uh, competitive Pokemon there. It's a good way to, like, play around with the team builder and everything, right? Yeah, it's super fun. And if you, like, really get into it, there's tournaments of real money for competitive Pokemon. Ooh. There's ranked battles? Yeah, there's ranked battles. Uh, Poke Pokemon's got a full competitive scene. Competitive Pokemon, it's in the game. Whatever Pokemon game you're playing, uh, Pokemon Scarlet and Violet right now are the main ones, right? So yeah. 
Can you find it on iPhone? No, it does not work on iPhone. Your computer can't play Peak game? Rip, sorry. Did you extract the did you extract the zip file? Did you read the instructions? <laughs> Need to extract the zip file. Remember Ludwig? Yeah, Ludwig's played competitive Pokemon 4. He's played Pokemon Showdown online. Woo! Let's see. Pick a game should run on your computer. Do you know how to exact, uh, extract a file? If you're on Mac or Linux, it won't. But if you're on Windows, you have to extract it. It is it is not on phone. You cannot play Pika game on phone. Okay, there's three Pokemon in the field. This is actually really good. This might be the play. This might be the play. Huge. Okay. Uh, we have a random Weedle. We'll just drop him there. Okay. This is actually really good. Oh my god. Double Garchomp. When's your birthday? December 23rd, so not soon. It's an amazing stream. Thank you. I mean, it's doing really well. The view count's like popping off like... This is actually a good stream, not gonna lie. I think it's fun. We have an active chat. I'm trying my best to uh, interact with y'all. Oh, it's a little tricky. There's 114 of y'all, so chat's going a little bit faster than uh, it usually does in my normal streams, but it's, it's great, great, it's great. Is that Luigi? So, for, dude, Luigi's very hot. Luigi's my, ooh, Luigi's, Luigi's my spirit animal. I, I am literally Luigi. If I was uh, green and Mario shaped. I do that. Oh, no. Yes! He fits! Oh my god! Your birthday's the day before yours? Oh yeah, December 22nd is the day my dad was born as well. Congratulations, dad! Hello there, poppy. Ooh, let's see. Okay. I'm gonna duplicate over there. I don't think that's a play. I think the play is that we... Somehow get rid of those guys over there. Huge! Oh, that's really good. Let's see. Okay. Oh my god. Hmm. Let's see. Woo! Alright, bing bong bing. Okay, there's that. Like, have you ever played VR? Yes, I have an HTC Vive. Yeah. Ooh, I do have one. Sorry, my mom was texting me. Sorry, I was a little silent. My mom was telling me, you're spending more money than you're making. You're draining your savings. I had to buy a capture card that was $180 the other uh, day. Because my, my thing broke, so... Yeah, I'm a little low on money. I, uh, I spent a lot of my money. Like, what, did you finish it? I did not beat it, no. I beat an era game, though, but not Pika game. Big game's actually hard. Let's see. Are they gonna touch? Shiny Arceus in this, or getting actual Arceus in this? Sh shiny Arceus is definitely harder. Because we haven't even got a shiny yet, and you have to get. I mean, you, you need one shiny, then you need that shiny to actually be an ingredient in the Arceus. It depends. It's. You'll probably get both. They're, they're kind of like 50-50, because by the time you get Arceus, you'll probably have a shiny. Let's see. Do that. Ooh, what's your favorite shiny? I don't know if I can label a favorite right now. It's a little tricky. That whooper is really, really annoying. Hold on. Put that over there. Okay, okay. Let's let's try, let's try. You made this? This looks dope. Thank you, thank you. Okay, hold on. If I can just get that Pikachu out of there, we'll be in a good spot. Um No, they're being pushed away! They're being pushed away! No! This is actually a good run as well. We have two tapus on the bottom. If they touch, we get a grout on there, and then we'll be halfway there. Oh no. What city do you live in? That might be too much information. TMI, TMI. Ooh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Ooh, have you played Elden Ring? Yes, I have played Elden Ring. Yes. Yes! Groudon! Okay, we're halfway there. 
We're halfway there. What's harder, Shiny God or Tropius? Oh, Tropius is way harder than a Shiny Arceus. Tropius is way harder than Shiny Tropius by like a lot. I mean, Tropius is way harder than Shiny Arceus by a large margin. Only one person's got a Tropius legit. Let's see. Kind of tricky. We're in a good spot though. We're, we're not in a bad spot. This is a good run. Put that there. Boo doo. These Weedles are really, really bad. These Weedles are actually really, really bad. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Ooh, not bad. No, they didn't touch anything. The stream after this thing's not working yet. Yeah, it's because I don't have it on. No, oh, come on, come on. It's not on, so yeah. Let's see. Ooh, that's a little dangerous. You ever done a Dark Souls stream? Yes, I've done Dark Souls 3, a full playthrough of Dark Souls 3 on stream, as well as a little bit of Dark Souls Remastered. I didn't beat Dark Souls Remastered because y'all, it wasn't doing very well in views. And I love Dark Souls, but y'all weren't watching it. And it's kind of sad. I, I wish I wish y'all liked Dark Souls more. Ooh. 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 Wait, hold on. Give me a moment. Give me a moment. Wait, what? Go down there. Go down there. The Pikachu ruining? He's literally... We'd have a Tapu Lele by now. Please. Please. Go! Go! You have a Fortnite code? I had one, and then Fortnite took it away because nobody used it, so... I will wait a bit before I get another one. You know? Hold on, hold on. Can we cook? Can we cook? <gasps> yes! Oh my god, we need one more guard chump and we get another ground on. Okay. Cheesy, oh, it's a pair. Next time you get a code, you'll exclusively use your code. Well, it won't be for a while. The code I originally had was Code Crusade, but no longer works. So, oh well. It was nice while it lasted. Let's see. Put that over there. Okay. It's not gonna touch. It's not gonna touch. It's a really good run, though. That Pikachu, that Pikachu's doing nightmares. But Garchomp's, I mean, not Garchomp, Groudon's so big that I think two Groudons will touch each other anyways. I need somewhere to put this Weedle. I have this Wooper that won't hurt anything. I put Wooper here safely. Yes, the answer was yes. Go down, go down. Yes! Oh, that was good. Oh, we just we, we got a lot of room back with that. Okay. Oh. Oh, that, that's close. That's close. Put that there. Oh wait, this isn't this the Pika game music? Yeah, this is the Pika game title screen music. Let's go. Oh, we're in danger. We're in danger. No! You're kidding me! You're kidding me! Oh, it's done, it's done. We're dead, we're dead. There's no way to recover. I, I can't recover. Mobile's too big. We... Uh, okay, okay. If we had a Bulldore, Boulder goes here. Boulder transforms into Mobile. Mobile turns into uh, Dewblade. Dewblade turns into Rotom. Rotom turns into uh, Garchomp. Garchomp turns into Tapu Lele. Tapu Lele turns into Groudon. Groudon's so big we're getting an Arceus. Oh my god. Literally, literally lock. Literally lock. Literally lock. Oh. Oh. I just needed a Bulldore or two Pikachus. Well, let's stick Pikachu here. Oh, we get a Pikachu after this. Is there a way we can set this so it doesn't kill us? I don't think so. I, I don't think so. I, I don't think there's a way we win this. Hmm. 
No, I don't, I don't think there's a way we win this. No. No, wait, we don't. <sighs> Damn it. Like the game, you made it? Yes. Oh, no. No, 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 that was so good. We got the... Wait, they gave us the Pikachu after the Mobile. Why did they give us the Pikachu afterwards? Alright, let's, let's give it another shot. That was a really good run. That was a really good run. The thing is, there's a lot of luck in this game. There's not much. You, you did so good, it was really good. Goodness gracious, it's fine though. It's fine. Play picking him now? Bueno. How do you play Weedle Mode? Uh, it's not in the regular game yet. Uh, so the one you're downloading right now is version 1.3. Weedle Mode's actually in version 1.4 and that's not pub public yet. Version 1.4, I'll probably upload. I think, I was waiting for Pear to stream it before I did version uh, 1.4. Right? So uh, I'll probably upload that soon. I'll let y'all know though. There'll be a community post when I uh, update the game. What's harder, Shiny Weedle or basically another Shiny? Shiny Weedle is technically going to be harder to get than the other Shinies. Because if you get a Shiny Weedle, you can get every other Shiny. But if you get a Shiny Weedle, the only way to get a Shiny Weedle is by a Shiny Weedle. If you know what I mean, right? We haven't seen a Shiny Weedle outside of like Weedle games, so he is actually kind of harder. Let's see. Yeah, sorry. I'll, you know, there'll be a community post when Weedle Mode comes out. Let's see. Hmm. Said so you make fan videos, but not have any talents applicable to that. Yeah, no, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I just think it's really cool to uh, give credit to those that do. All right, let's see. This isn't too bad of a run. I don't think this is as good as the last run, but it's not like awful. I mean, the mobiles need a touch. Please touch mobiles, please. That would be very cool, please. What's a game called Pika Game? There's a link to it in the description down below. Okay. Boom, boom, boom. Guard shot. No, the Pikachu's carrying the weight of the world on his shoulders. Congratulations, Pikachu. Alright. Your black and white music, I think it's not Gen 4, yeah. At least I don't, I don't think it's Gen 4. Actually, actually, it might be Gen 4. It might be like Soul Silver or something. But I don't think it's I don't think it's Diamond Pro or Platinum. Hi hell there, you need Chisia or something. Is there a follow which command? I don't think so, no. Pikachu running, it's always Pikachu. Like, right now, Pikachu's blocking the two uh, guard jumps from touching each other. Always Pikachu's fault. Always blame Pikachu. Stupid mascot of the series. Getting cocky. Big cock. Okay, let's drop him over there. Let's see. Put that there. Hmm. Weedle in the way. Not too big of a deal. We'll get another one right now. Alright, let's see. You sub? Thank you, KD Gaming. It says Suica Game? Well, Pika Game's not actually a tab in the thingy. Pika Game is a fan game of Suica Game anyways. So Suica Game's the game I based it on. So it's uh, rather close. Let's see. Is this a mobile game? No, this is a computer game. I just have it cropped so it fits on the stream better. It is not a mobile game. Why haven't you subbed yet? Let's go. Yeah, yeah if you aren't subbed... Why not? It is free and easy. What's the highest Pokemon? So Arceus is the obvious highest Pokemon. There's, if you if you fuse two Arceus together, you get a Tropius. Boom, boom, boom. This is stupid. This is stupid God for a second game. Okay, well that's not awful. Yeah, 52 likes. Oh yeah, 52 likes. Yo, if you don't like the stream as well, also likes the stream. Helps out a lot. We'll probably be ending decently soon. Yeah, this might be the last one or second last run, but we Gucci, we Gucci, we vibin'. Oh, you dropped that there. That there. Boom, Bulldor, okay. We have three guard chomps on the screen. You are actually kidding me. Oh, there we go, we fixed that. Now we only have two. We have a Tapu in the middle of the screen, though. Oh, we should probably retry it. This is not a good run. All right, this will be the last run. Last run. Final run. Ooh, that, that run was just over. Let's see. Hmm. Actually, did you know the Pokemon Company shut down the Relic Castle website? Yes. I did. That's kind of depressing. That's very depressing because 
It was a free website for Pokemon fan games. And I, I really don't know why they took it down. Makes me feel a little scared because this is a Pokemon fan game, but it is what it is. Not much you can do about it. We just gotta kind of like it's legally in the right, even if it's really annoying and kind of kind of kind of tone deaf, kind of kind of stupid. Whatever. Oh, you're good enough to make video game music for a job. Uh, that would be cool. That would be cool. In fact, ooh, if I ever make like a game that I need I need a musician for. Uh, the plan is to make like a uh, Mario Party style game uh, down the line. We got the rare sub notification, let's go. A Mario Party style game down the line. And for that, I would need all custom assets, because I think I would want to put that on the Steam store. And obviously you need a real game for that, right? So I might have to actually commission uh, music for that. Let's see, imagine how it takes down an air game, because it's an air fan game. Imagine. Ooh, corporation sucking per usual. It's, it's like really unfortunate. It's like... It's a fan game. They're they're advertising their series. It's it's for fun, and then and Pokemon's like, mm, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Let's see, Weedle. Okay, drop Boulder there. Boom boom. Huge. Okay. Uh, let's see what now. Put him there. You gotta lock and learn as much as you can from your courses? Yeah, just keep on learning. Let's alter 3 to 6 pixels per sprite. How about I just rotate it instead? Trimple is that. Okay, we have Whooper. Not really anything crazy. Oh wait, drop the two mobiles here. Boom, free, uh, free Rotom. Okay. Hell yeah. Hmm. Toho aka Godzilla has been destroying Godzilla fan games? That's, that's so sad. But it is what it is, you know. It's, it's legally in the right. It's just annoying as hell. Ugh. If they're not profiting off it, just just let them just let them do. They're they're literally advertising your series. I imagine the people making the games are the people watching the movies as well. You make a game purely about the lore of Nera. Well, that's the plan. I just want it to be good. I want to get practice. I want to be ready for that to happen. I want to be, I want to be ready for whenever I make a full narrow game, you know? Be like Sega. Sega's pretty chill. They, they literally got the Sonic Mania guys. They were, they were fan game devs. Like, are you winning, son? I'm going to be honest. I don't, I don't think so. This isn't an awful run, but I don't think it's a good run either. Let's see. Hmm. What about we build a secret game of every Pokemon? That would either take a long time, because you'd have to go through a, like a billion tiers, or it wouldn't be like very interesting. Oh, that was good! Whoa! Okay, okay, that actually, that might have put us back in the playing field. Woo! Hell yeah, hell yeah. Drop that there. Boom. Guard chomp. Okay, actually not bad. Okay. Nintendo doesn't understand what's really allowed? No, Nintendo Nintendo knows exactly what's allowed. That's why they do it. Uh, I don't think you understand. Nintendo knows exactly their legal rights. That's the issue. Ooh. Let's see, let's see. Okay, we have a Rotom over there. Okay, what now? We have Boldor. We can make Duplet here. The blade's probably gonna fall down, that's fine. Hmm. Is there a speedrun category? No. I don't think there. I don't think Pika, I don't think Pika Games on spe uh, speedrun.com. Nintendo lawyers are max level, they unfortunately are. I promise, they know exactly what they can do. That that's why they do it. Hold on. Speedrun.com. Pika game. Ain't no way it's there. No, it it, it brings up hey you Pikachu. Yeah. All right. Woo! If you're against Nintendo, Nintendo just has like the best lawyers in the business. They're just, there's just nothing you can do. Are you losing, son? We're doing decent. I want to say we're doing bad. Just not doing like good as well. We've had a better run that we lost, so don't want to get cocky. Drop that there. Okay, that's going to touch. Okay, I think I think it's fine. 
I think it's fine if those don't touch. We can live with that. That's actually, that's not a bad scenario. Drop those down there. Boom, boom. Okay. We just got to build like a Garchomp in between them. And then whenever we get the second Garchomp, we'll, we'll get a free Groudon. Instant Groudon. Are you doing decent, son? I think decent's fine enough, yeah. I, I, I think we're doing fine enough that I can say decent. Yeah, not too shabby. Let's see. We have this Wooper, uh, the Weedle. I can't really do anything with that. Ah, oh, this Weedle sucks. Okay, what if I do this? Let's see. Hmm. They're not touching. They're not touching. They're not touching! Hold on, hold on. Okay, okay. I think we're fine, we're fine. Let's go, Groudon! Okay, not too shabby, we're halfway there. Huge, Lone Spin's voice. Thank you. I appreciate that. It's so weird, I say this all the time. I, it, it, that's a weird compliment I get every now and then. But in real life, I never, I've never gotten that compliment. But when I got streaming, people will just say that. It, it's strange, you know? Don't know why. Wimbrel, Crusader for one month? Thank you very much! Oh my god, that's amazing! I appreciate it. Welcome. Do that. Let's go, huge. We can do that, boom. Wait, 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 hold on. That's a Tapu Lele. Holy shoot, this is actually a run. Oh, we need one more Tapu and we win. Can we do that? Can we get a Tapu in the last run? One last one. And Sprinkles three bumps. Hell yeah, hell yeah, baby. Okay. Put that there. That there. Bing bing. Okay, not too shabby, actually. Dooblit already? Okay, okay, I, I need to be careful. No, that Weedle there is going to kill me later. He's going to bite me so hard in the butt. Oh, no, 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 no. That Weedle is going to hurt me so bad. Okay, this is fine. We have a Garchomp. Guess what? He's on the Weedle. What makes you add Tapu Lele? I needed uh, a Jin 7 rep. I also needed a sub legendary. So that's why we have a uh, Tapu Lele. Shrimple is that. I also think Tapu Lele is cute. It's a cute Pokemon. Hmm. Okay. <gasps> the Weedles are going to touch. 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 I think we give it enough time they will touch. Okay. Shove that there. Make them touch. Okay. <gasps> yes. Double Whooper now. Okay. That's not bad, that's not bad. Ooh, this is actually kind of good. Hey, yo. Way, yo. Kind of, kind of good, not gonna lie. Oh, we have literally everything on the field necessary to win. We have a decent amount of space left. I just, I just need the things to touch correctly. We have everything we need. Oh, this is so bad. Oh no. No, no, no. Dooblade's moving down. Oh no, 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 no. No, no, no. Oh, there's a little bit of delay. There's a little bit of delay. All right, well, that's it, that's it, that's it. We're done, we're done. We've been here for two hours. Oh, well then, well then. Thank you guys all so much for coming over to a fantastic stream. We'll be again, we'll be back in, I don't know, tomorrow. Uh, I don't know tomorrow, but we'll be back again soon. Oh, she actually clicked a cam in video. We'll be back in tomorrow or some other day. So until then, audience bro, Chachos, Hacker Sage signing out. Thanks for coming uh, for as long as you did until we meet again. Woo! So yeah, oh my goodness, good stream though, good stream though.
Really good amount of viewership. Glad you could all come around and see Peak Game for as long as we did. But until then, Audios Bro Chachos, Hacker State signing out. Bada booey. Outro time. I, I still need to fix the outro. That, that, ignore that. It says sub in case you don't know. <laughs>